back, ladies and gents. Oh man, has it been a minute? We're out here getting a late start, guys. Ladies and gents, it's been over a month. I got something new. I got a new toy I want to show you guys. I'm out here with my pops and my dad. Let me put this thing on my, on my. Let me clip this thing on and let me show you guys what I got. Right over here, guys, we got a pretty sure you guys can't really hear me, but we got a max painting rods generator. It is a 3500 watt starting and 3000 running, guys. I'm looking to do a full review on that. It's my first night out here. I want to go out there and fish with a couple anglers, but I'm looking to test this generator out, see if I can. It's pulling two lights. I mean, it's 3,000 running, 3,500 starting. I'm going to do a full night review here. And we're going to see if it actually holds up. How many gallons of gas is it going to burn through one whole night? And hopefully, you know, it's good for a two-people combo. Me and T-Bone used to go out. We'll go out there with just one light, and it'll be plenty of light. But two, it's always, it's always a lot better. So let's see how it holds up, guys. And we're going to try to get out there and catch some trout. Yeah, stay tuned. Oh my god, there's one. There's one. Hmm. Finally. Finally. She... Hmm. Oh, can't get her in. First one of the night. Huh? She looks like a solid keeper. <clears throat> solid, solid keeper. Not oversized or anything. Want to tocaña, pa? Tocaña? That chiquita. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at that. 15 inch of trout. That chiquita. 15. <laughs> she goes to live another day. Lucky best. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. This one looks tiny. That one looks tiny. Gotta be careful with those triple hooks. See, that chiquita. This is a baby right here. This is a male. It's a male because the males don't grow as big as the females. If you guys didn't know. Oh. Oh, they'll live. They're starting to show up, boys. Hopefully we get some solid keepers. Got him interested in it, so that's a good sign. So we can get them to commit, guys. Just burning it through the mid surface, and there's a oh, there's one. That's a good one. Yep. My for sure. Oh, she's about to come out. She's about to come out. Oh, right in the net. Oh. This is Mikey. 
really bad that job. Mm. Se ve chiquilla, ¿no? It looks small. She looks like she would just make it. Let's get her. Easy girl. Get that hook removed. That's the most important part. There it is. Tato. Ben skins. Where are you? First keeper. We're about to rig up a alert. Soft plastic with some get you some salty heads. That's what I use. These are the chick heads I use, guys. Use promo code Texas Fishing Addict at checkout and you save some money on your purchase. Fan of, of these down south lures right here, these baby blue with the short shoes tone. And trout love pink for some reason. They love pink, so that'd be a perfect match. Not too heavy of a jig head. It's a 16 downs. Yeah guys, get you some. I'll link the description. I'll link the link down below and Use promo code Texas Fishing Attic. Support a local, you know. George, the owner, is a pretty cool guy. Been buying from him since before he had his website and everything. Let's get out there to see if that stuff produces, guys. They're being really finicky right now, so just trying anything and everything on the tackle box. There's one, small though, small. Put her in the chair. Put her in the VIP chair. Oh crap. I'm telling you guys when, it's the one thing you gotta be careful with. These dang treble hooks. Look at that. They're all about that size. Speckle trout. Some solid ones in there, but they don't want to commit. We're going to get them to commit. ¿Qué salieron otros? ¿Sí le dieron piquete? I think it's better to put it on a gancho of those three, dude. Los chiquititos, dude. There's one. Otro. Look at that, boys. We're catching them off the little shad, actually. Oh, easy, girl. Easy. Otra. Sí. ¿Qué le cambio el gancho, tío? So guys, you see, there's still lots of trout out there. 
it's still early I mean it's already 3.45 in the morning chopping at them all night but it's just they want the live bait so that's why they've been a little bit more finicky at hitting the lures just like you see they'll still come up and hit it there's some big ones in there that don't really want to come in because we gotta avoid we gotta go through all the little ones to get the big ones <sighs> only one keeper so far it's been a grind but they're out there boys they're out there like crazy Thank you. No way I'm gonna sleep in here. 